Hello everyone, welcome to my channel ASP.NET Core and today I'm going to show you how to uh, read XML file in ASP.NET Core. So, so first of all you can see that is the XML file and here we have a root uh, com component you can say you root node you can say employees and the single employee data we have ID name and the country and the ID is one name is Jacob and the country is United States similarly employee 2 employee 3 and employee 4 so you can see uh, here we have a employee.xml file how to read this file uh, in asp.net core uh, so that is the today's topic and uh, uh, i'm going to teach you one by one steps so for first of all you can use iweb host environment file uh, sorry interface uh, in your controller section and after that initialize that iweb host environment uh, uh, interface uh, in your uh, constructor of your controller section okay after that you can use a list of employee uh, model and uh, here we have a employee model is the view model class and you can use xml document to read your xml file so xml document is actually exist in the system.xml namespace you so just you can use it uh, before use uh, xml document uh, class file okay now after that you can uh, load that file from your ww root folder where your xml file is exist so environment iweb host environment is actually located that file and you can use uh, so um, iweb host environment is used to trace the path of the actual file where where uh, xml file is actually exist or any other file will ac actually exist so after that you can uh, load uh, doc dot load method to load the file XML file and one by one you can uh, use uh, by using for each loop of the XML nodes so here we have a file of uh, uh, employee model so here is the uh, employees and employee is the node of the um, XML file so you can use it here uh, selected node that is employees and employee so that is the path so one node actually one employee and uh, after that um, uh, traverse that uh, node one by one by using their for each loop and inserted that one by one data into the uh, view model class or i actually i want to add only inner text of that xml file like the one jacob and united states okay so that is the inner uh, html inner text of the xml file okay so node and the name of the um, na name of the inner text that is the name country and id and after that you can return the employees and uh, in employee model class you can see that id name and countries actually exist employee id name and the country similarly uh, you can generate the view according to the uh, xml file so just you can see the view section and just go to the home and index.cshtml file and where we have employee id name and the country and one by one and data iterate uh, and uh, uh, run on your uh, browser easily so that's method is used to read xml file in asp.net core so you can use it and uh, read the xml file and just after that we can create the xml file by using asp.net core and uh, you can see uh, both method existing at here okay so that is the easiest method to create a simple database in asp.net core by using xml file so just create it and uh, read it uh, in the form of uh, the data so thank you very much for watching this video and keep watching all other videos which is related to asp.net core and any other help please ping me and uh, comment on this channel thank you very much